Let's keep it going, guys, for a guy Davis! Look, I've got mental health problems, I've got made mistakes, all right? Don't be talking about that. So, um, I was going to talk about my mental health, um, but I think I'll talk about something else that you might be a bit more on board with. Um, it's magic mushroom season. I have bipolar affective disorder with occasional psychosis. Superpowers, I call it. I've got enough machines for us all. They say now that um, I think it's a third of the UK population suffers with some form of mental health condition. When we get to 50%, that's when we're going to make a move. <laughs> If you're unsure, right, I'll just raise a point. Now, in the film The Matrix, Morpheus offers Neo the choice of two pills, a red and a blue. Now, if you would have chosen the blue pill where the true nature of reality is revealed, then psychedelics could be for you. But if you thought to yourself, fuck it, I'll take them both and see what happens, they're definitely for you. <laughs> We've got a saying in our village that goes back generations and generations of Your cousin's okay to practice on. <laughs> After a few more hours, I remember becoming sort of viscerally aware that I was connected to the collective unconscious. And life wasn't a series of random events, but an expression of a deeper underlying order. When I looked up into the heavens, there was this ethereal glow, radiating rays of refulgent light and love. I could almost touch it. Boy, it said, never live in fear of anything in this life. What is just a waste of your imagination. Life is transient, but your soul is eternal. Tidy, I thought. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go! 